back to my channel. So in this video, I'm showing you guys how I achieved this pink cheetah print cut crease look. So if you guys like to see how I did this, then please keep on watching. I'm taking this pink shade from the Zulu palette by Juvia's Place and I'm stamping the color on my crease just so I get the most color payoff. And I'm using my Luxie Mini Flat Angled 111 brush. I'm slightly blending it out and then I'm using the two pink shades from the Take Me Back to Brazil palette and I'm blending it all out with my M506. Packing that pink color in a little bit more so it's more vibrant and then blending everything out one final time. I'm cleaning up any fallout that came onto my lid with a makeup wipe and q-tip and now I'm going in with concealer to cut my crease and I'm using a stamping method because I notice it comes out a lot more crisp and cleaner and I'm using my favorite E19 brush. I'm going in with my ABH M Razy palette and I'm taking the shade Wasted and applying it all onto my lid. I'm cleaning up the edge with a makeup wipe to create a sharp line. I'm using this liquid eyeliner by LA Colors to create the cheetah print. I'm doing C shape patterns and I'm doing it in patterns of 2, 3, and 4 and I'm also adding in some dots to get the illusion of the cheetah print. So I'm just going to be repeating the same pattern onto my whole entire lid. I'm taking the shade Reezy from the Ambreezy palette and I'm going to be filling in the cheetah print and I'm using this really small detailed brush from BH Cosmetics. And I'm going back in with the eyeliner to really make the cheetah print pop since the shadow kind of covered it and made it look a little dull. Moving on to the bottom lash line, I'm applying the same pink shade from the Zulu palette. And then I'm going in with the two pink shades from the BH Cosmetic palette and blending everything out. And I'm applying my Hank and Henry mascara to my bottom lashes. I'm taking these three shades from the Babe in Paradise highlighter palette and applying it to my inner corner. I'm also applying the shade Barbs from the Embrazy palette. For lashes, I'll be using these Sumptuous Beauty lashes, and these are in the style Sumptuous. And I'm applying them on with my tweezer, and I'm applying that liquid eyeliner just to cover the lash band. I'm taking my NYX Glitter Primer and I'm applying three little dots with my tweezers and then I'm applying three little rhinestones onto my bottom lash line. And this is the final result. I hope you guys really enjoyed this look. I have to say I'm obsessed with it. It's still simple but yet glam with the rhinestones. If you guys enjoyed it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out!